Hey y'all, so we check in in like 18 hours to go to Dubai. So y'all, I'm just about to, I'm actually already packed, but not necessarily repack, but just make sure I have everything. So I did some last minute shopping at Sephora in Ulta, and then I did a lot of last minute shopping at Amazon. So, from Sephora, I got um, the Five Peach Eyeshadow Palette um, Concealer, the Gloss Balm, and the Matte Powder Foundation, the Pro Filter. Um, I'm actually mad because I have this somewhere. I just cannot find it. I gave my sister and one of my cousins um, a ton of makeup and I'm, now I'm thinking that I gave them this but I don't know why I would have. I don't know but I end up having to buy one because I cannot find mine. And then from Sephora um, I got another gloss balm. So this one is in the color it's is it fussy and then the one I got from Sephora is in the color tulip kiss. And then from Amazon, again, with me buying things that I already have. So I bought a cover for my suitcase, um, cut out the base suitcase. And just in case I have to check it or even just putting it on the conveyor belt for them to the x-ray thing. Like, I don't want any scuffs or anything on it. So I bought this. This is my second time buying it because I have one. I just have no idea where it is. Like. It kind of pissed me off to even buy this because I know I have one. Again, on things I've already bought, this is the perfume, um, like the, the travel perfume container. I've already bought this. Both of these were together, the first set that I bought because everything that I was taking to Dubai with me, everything that I was traveling with, I had all together and now I cannot find them. So I had to repurchase them up. Last thing that I repurchased was a battery for my camera again i've already had a second battery because i want a backup battery so when mine dies i can just pop the other one back in my camera while i'm charging the other one again i have no idea where this other battery is like it is driving me insane because i'm really pissed that i spent money on things that i have already bought now granted the battery i bought was like maybe over a year ago but still i do not understand how they got separated from all of my other camera stuff and then this stuff i bought like um like a month ago and i lost and then the last thing i got from amazon um were just some well they're supposed to be mini makeup brushes but these look like these might be like full size i just wanted some mini ones to pack with but just looking at this box i feel like these are like full size brushes i'll open it in a minute um, if you watch me reviewing my base um all of my base bail on me if you watch my video where i reviewed all of my base items um when i reviewed this backpack i completely forgot about this pocket that is right here and so i'm gonna put my laptop in this pocket it's just not in there right now because i need to charge my laptop and actually i'm gonna do some editing while i get my hair done i'm gonna get my hair done um tomorrow i'm getting it braided so i have a lot of like last minute things i have to do i gotta go get waxed i gotta go um to the bank get my hair done i gotta run by work i should be done with work but i have to run by work for like literally like five minutes tomorrow um, so tomorrow is a very, 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 um, this is, tomorrow's a very eventful day. So, in my backpack, I have, I don't know what I have. Let's see what's in here. I need to work on this stuff a little bit better. So I will say this is the first trip, but I just feel like super organized. Like because of everything that I have bought from Base, I just feel like super, super organized. So in my backpack, so there's a pocket right here. This pocket has my chargers in it. So I have this MagSafe wireless charger so I can charge my phone and I can charge my Apple Watch with it and I can charge my AirPods. I just lay everything on it. What I don't like 
and that it takes a lightning cord instead of a type C. Yeah, it takes a lightning cord instead of a type C. So where I really want to just take one cord with me, I have to take two cords with me. So this cord will power my charger and then this cord just powers everything else. Um, really I'm taking this cord because of my MacBook. So this little pocket that I have in here is um, for my cords and my MagSafe charger. Okay, also from Amazon, I ordered this converter for the outlet. So it's a Tessin. I bought this. So it has a two USB chargers in the front, a USB-C on the front, and then like our standard US port here. Um, there's some outlets on the side. I don't really know what those go to. And then of course, this is what goes in the wall. Now I'm just gonna take the instructions with me. I may need them. And then that is going to go in this front pocket. It's also in here, I am taking my Tory Burch purse so really the only bag that i will be taking is when i'm dressed up i will be taking my toy birth purse when i'm dressed down i will be carrying my baby's sling pouch and then my jewelry case which there is nothing in here except for a bracelet we are going to the gold souks which is like the market in dubai so i'm going i'm not taking any jewelry with me other than um the bracelet i have in here my everyday wear necklace that i wear in my wedding ring of course i don't have any of that i don't have any of that on right now because i took it off i'm gonna go to bed soon but um that's literally the only three items I'm taking with me and then I'm just gonna purchase some jewelry while I am down there. So that is going in my backpack. Um, this dop kick from Bays is going in there. So it has all of my toiletries and my makeup and stuff, but I'm gonna put that in last because I need to put some more things in it. Okay, y'all, so now on to the dog kit. All right, so I have like all of my toiletry items up top, and then I have all of my makeup items in the bottom. All right, y'all, so in my toiletry bag, I have my contact solution, Clorox wipes, um, drops for my eyes if they get dry, some Sensodyne toothpaste. Yes, I'm at the point to where I have to use Sensodyne now. My teeth were getting so sensitive with cold or hot stuff. Dove lotion. Um, okay, y'all. So when I went, so my last trip was to Disney World a few months ago, and I have full bodies of my Korean sunscreen. Not sunscreen, my Korean skincare. So I didn't take any of them with me. I just took like my La Roche Posay travel um cleanser and then like more also oils moisturize my face and my face broke out so bad so i was like i don't want to be without my skincare especially for a week so i found travel sizes of the korean skincare in the brand claire's so i have the cleansing oil the facial cleanser um the moisturizer and um the toner so and then I have my Guru Nanda oil, oil pulling mouthwash and then a goodie in case I have a headache. I'll probably put another goodie in here just in case I need it. And then on the inside of this bag has a toothbrush holder. So I have my toothbrush. So that is all of this. And then one thing that I'm adding are the scrub and bubbles disinfectant wipes for the bathroom when we get there. My last two travel experiences in hotels were not the best as far as cleanliness, so I'll do it myself. Oh, um, the last thing I'm gonna put at the top once I consolidate it, so I make my own. Oh, it looks like my husband already. Okay, he already did this one, cool. Okay, so I was about to say, um, I make my own shea butter. And so this is just over the times of traveling. So like here's 
a container with some. Here's one that my husband already filled up. And then here's some. Um, I didn't know he filled it up. I thought this one was just like half full. So I was gonna consolidate everything. But it looks like he already did it. So yeah, I don't wear lotion out of the store or anything. I, um, I make my own body butter. So that's what this is. Keep saying last thing. Last, last thing for the top is my roll on. Um, it's my body sunscreen. So this is by Kapari um, SPF 40 Sun Shield. I was using Black Girl Sunscreen, but I'm just trying to be really careful about the things that I put on my body, in my body. I'm trying to use as clean of products as possible. So I switched to this. I absolutely love it. It smells so good. It has like a vanilla sweet scent to it. And I love it because everything that I wear is pretty much vanilla. So that's going in here as well. All right. So I have, I don't even know where to start. I have so much stuff here. Um, so I'll do my, um, I don't know why I can't think. Like, I don't know why words don't come to mind. Eyeshadows. Like, I, don't, I was gonna say mascara. I have my eyeshadows, my pro filter matte foundation, my gloss bombs, and my concealer. Um, so I have this foundation stick in there, but I put this in there because I didn't know if I was going to be able to find the powder. But since I have the powder, um, I can actually not put this in there now. Have my setting powder. And I actually don't need this anymore since I bought the glass lip balm, the glass, the glass lip balm. Y'all, what is up with me? The gloss balm stick. The gloss balm stick and this are kind of similar. Not really, but they're in the same family. So I actually don't need this anymore. I have my e.l.f. liquid blushes. So one, what colors are these? Gorge orange. And pinky promise. And then I have my e.l.f. highlighter in shampoo campaign campaign and another blush in rose you slay and then I have my contour but I don't think I'm gonna take my contour because I have my bronzer and I can pretty much do the same thing yeah I'm not gonna take my contour I'm just gonna take my bronzer so I have my Fenty bronzer in coconutty and I was actually gonna take this in place of um, eyeshadow, but since I purchased the little small fancy um, eyeshadow, I'm not going to take this anymore. This helps, this helps me really eliminate things. I have my mascara, and I have these little towelettes for, that I got from Amazon, not Amazon, um, that I got from Sheen. So I wanna use these to wash my face with. I put those in last. And I don't need this. Why do I have this in here? I don't even know why I have this in here. So I can take that out. And then this is a mirror. So I'm gonna take the mirror with me. And then my Fenty blotting powder. I definitely need another one, but I'm just gonna continue to use this up before I get another one. Fenty gets entirely too much of my money. Like, especially when Fenty first came out, I literally bought every single product that came out. And I don't even wear makeup like that. But it was just, I don't know. I don't know. Um, and then I have the Honey Mustard Eye Brightener from Fenty. Putting that in there. And then I have three lip liners. So this is actually the Tattoo Peel Off Lip Liner. I got that from Amazon. This is the Fenty Traced Out Pencil Lip Liner in Rubber Bands. And then this, no, am I taking this one? Hold on, where is my... Oh, you know, I purposely, I purposely didn't pack it. And then this is my MAC, MAC lipstick in Plum. I really only got the Plum to see if it's gonna go with my Is It Fussy um, gloss foam that I packed. So that's going, and then I, hmm. I didn't put my eyeliner in here. Okay, so I need to put my eyeliner in here. So I have tape for my eyeliner. So I'm gonna put that in here. And then, oh, 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 okay. 
I do have other things. I'm like, where is, I know I packed some more stuff. Okay, so this is my Costa Riche. So it's actually, this is a, what is this? Cause this is not a lip liner. This is an eyeliner and I have been using it as a lip liner for the last few years and I absolutely love it. It's in the color Costa Riche. So I'm taking this and then my Fenty Fly Liner eyeliner in, what color is this? Cause I'm black. So yeah. And then I have this tape and then this eyeliner aid that I bought <laughs> off of Shein to guide my eyeliner even though I'm probably still going to, it's still gonna be a disaster. I'm just gonna do it because why not? I don't even know how it goes, cause I don't wanna take the instructions with me. So let's, how do I, how would I even do this? So this, I'm gonna go like this. This is just gonna be for jokes and giggles. Okay. It's so like this is the paper that it comes with to show you how to hold it up to your eye. And then just an extra sponge and then I had this in here this brush but I need to see what comes in this set because I may not even need this brush depending on what's in this set so I guess we're on to the set now so this is the BS small professional makeup tools it comes with 11 premium brushes so there's a face flat brush a powder brush blush brush angle brush liquid foundation brush small angle brush sponge puff small concealer brush classic eyebrow brush concealer brush lip brush eyebrow brush the last thing that i'm putting up under here so i'm going to take this um, arabian perfume that i bought i can't think of the name of it but y'all i feel played because i bought this perfume um when i was in baltimore last um last christmas and I paid forty dollars for it, and I went to go see if I could find it on Amazon because I'm like, when I run out, I can't go to Baltimore every time I need to repurchase it. Y'all, why was it nine dollars in Baltimore? I mean, why was it nine dollars on Amazon? I was a hot tomato. All right, so I'm gonna use the blue one. I've never used this before. Y'all see this? Got my perfume. Is this even close? Like nothing else can go on there. last thing is my sunscreen so I'm taking the Abib sunscreen I actually have two of these I have a regular one and a matte one but I feel like because it is going to be a hundred degrees in Dubai I probably need to go with my matte one because I don't need to put the oily one on top of me sweating and stuff so I'm taking that one and that is everything that will fit in this bag. And this is going. Y'all, the only thing that I'm like concerned about, I really don't have room to shop. I like really have like zero room to shop. Because the other thing too, like when I go, when I get ready to board, I'm gonna have this across me, this in my suitcase, and you can only board with two items. So I'm gonna have to put this in here just to board. And then I can take it out once I get on the plane. All right. So, oh, oh, oh. So I forgot to pack my fan, y'all. I gotta, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take this. 
save my fan. Because that is all that is going to fit in my backpack without it being overkill. So next is this bag. So in the front here, I have me and my husband's passport. We have passport covers, but I just took them off because they made it too bulky to fit in here. And then these two cards right here are just our um, global entry cards. And then it's empty because the camera that I'm filming on it's going to actually go into here so um my camera my extra battery so this is really going to just hold my camera stuff um my cards and our passport so that's really all that is going in here oh and the two things I forgot to add to my backpack um I have the like old headphones you'll see the end on here i have the old headphones and the adapter so if i'm on my macbook or if i'm watching the screen and like my airpods die or something i can switch to these time for this suitcase now just to give me a little extra room in my backpack i might actually end up putting my MacBook right here. I was gonna put it in my backpack, but I feel like this would just be a better spot just so I don't just stretch my backpack to capacity. So on this side, I have my clothes, which I need to go through here and figure out. Just make sure I have all the outfits I want. Nothing here. Nothing over there. Alright, so I'm taking three pair of shoes. Um, this pair, so I have these white tennis shoes that I actually bought from bought when I was in Puerto Rico. Um, just because I had only packed sandals and we did so much walking and my feet were hurting. So I pay like maybe twenty dollars for these. I'm packing these because we're gonna do the sand dunes and I was trying to figure out like what pair of shoes do I have that I would not mind getting dirty if I had to get them dirty. So even though they're white I don't mind getting these dirty. The second pair of shoes are these sandals. Um not sandals but like these little heel type sandals i trying to pick a shoe that went with like almost everything that i am packing so between these heels and my toy birch sandals that i'm wearing that covers every that should cover every outfit but i'm also checking that tonight just to double check um all of this stuff here are my underclothes and then everything in here is this is what is this this is my sleepwear and my swimsuit oh i know i didn't take out my outfit that i'm going to wear to the airport that's gonna also be my outfit that i'm going to wear while we are in paris okay so that is this outfit right here here do y'all want to see all my outfits or just wait to dubai we'll just let's just wait to dubai and then y'all can see all of my outfits well you know i still need to take them out so i need to make sure that that between those two shoes they go with everything but this is my outfit for the airport plus paris i thought it'd be a cute outfit to take pictures in while we were in paris so it's these trouser pants right here with like this mock neck cut off shirt and then I'm going to wear this jacket with it because I think it's going to be a little cool when we go to Paris. So I have this jacket that I'm going to wear along with it, but also wear on the plane as well. So that is my airport slash Paris outfit, y'all. Y'all, I think that is it as far as everything that I'm taking. I did get me some new camera accessories. I got me a new camera case. It used to be yellow, but I ordered me a black one. And then I ordered this arm strap for when I'm vlogging. And then I ordered this 
um, mini tripod. Like this is as long as it extends, but I got it because I was like, depending on how much vlogging I'm doing, I'm probably gonna get tired of like holding it like this. So I got this just so I can just kind of switch up how I'm holding it while I'm vlogging. And like I said, that stuff is going in this bag right here. So one, two, and three is going in here. Um, in my previous video, I showed y'all that I was putting my iPad in there, but I actually decided against taking my iPad. Um, I'll have my MacBook, I'll have my phone. That's all I need. All three of them do the same thing. So y'all, that is it. Um, I am pretty much done packing for Dubai. I need to throw one more dress in here. And yeah, next time I see y'all, I will be actually in Paris for our layover and then Dubai.